Hello. It's me. Uh, is this working? What's going on here? Come on, game. Well, the game doesn't want to seem to come back. Let's see. <clears throat> you can see it, because I can tell from my OBS that you can see it, but it won't come back to the foreground for me. Let's see. Oh, it doesn't want to. I'm going to have to start it over again, it looks like. It's a good start. It's a good way to start the day. Good way to start our adventure together today. Let's get it back up. Come on. Come on, you plucky little machine software. You can do it. I believe in you. Let's see. We've got a logo. We've got menacing sounding percussion we have a menu screen do we have okay i'm looking at the thing i'm seeing the thing and and oh it's doing it again it won't let me come back to the game why why, why, why? It's going to be one of those things, isn't it? This is just perfect. Bear with me, folks. We'll get it working. All right, I'm going to try launching the game and then not coming back to my OBS. Because that's what seems to confuse it now. This is a new problem. This has never happened before. It's always a new adventure. That's what makes it an open world role playing game. Because you never know what the adventure is going to be. Logo. Thunder sound. Main menu loading okay I'm playing the game but see now what I got to do is I got to go into my little twitch app on my Something I can get for you? device no thank you sir but I appreciate that and go look at my own channel to make sure it's actually playing let's see Oh, yeah, it is. Look at that. There's me. It's me doing exactly what I am doing, which I guess is the point. Cool. That's good. Back to the chat room loaded up. Good. Hi, Lydia. How have you been? I hope you're well. Missed you. Good. All right. I think we're ready to get this show on the road. More or less. What were we doing? <clears throat> Lost Expedition. I don't even know what that is. I have some sacred trials. But really, the thing I wanted to do was move along with the story. So, let's begin by recovering this journal first. Because it's apparently something I did a while ago. And never completed. But then we're going to get a move on and we're going to, you know, deal with the whole dragon situation. So let's do that. Oh, look. This guy just went to sleep. That's cute. That's cool. He probably works real hard. I really want to switch out of OBS again because I can't adjust the volume on Skyrim without actually leaving the app but this is just the world I'm living in right now I don't owe you money do I? no you don't owe me anything you're fine don't you worry 
Let's, uh, is there a place to wait for a coach here? There is not. So, let's see. We have to get to Dawnstar, I believe. Is my horse still here? Yeah. Where's Trotsky? New horse equipment available. Let's see. Rift in comparison. Well, that doesn't look good. For the banner. No! That looks terrible. That's what he needs to be. That's a good fit. Let's ride. Let's do it, Trotsky. Let's, uh, maybe... Oh, no. Now, you see, I've been playing Elder Scrolls Online, and my uh, muscle memory of the controls is a little screwy at the moment. Because I haven't been playing the rim for a while. Whoa, Trotsky. Trotsky. Come on. Come on. Let's be cool, man. Be cool. Like, the jump button is different. Okay, here we go. Onward, Trotsky! Ride as you have never rided before. Oh, look. Wolvesies. We'll deal with them later. Wait, is this the right way? Uh, wait. That's not where Strom's journal is. I'm all messed up. Where's, where's Strong? Oh, that's in a completely different spot than I thought it was. Never mind. We're not doing that one. We could just go straight to the main story then. Uh, let's see. Gain entrance of the Sky Haven Temple, which I actually have done before in this playthrough, but I never. Uh, I was way too early to be there. So I dealt with all sorts of uh, pain and grief. Where am I right now? I'm very far away. So I need to get somewhere where I can get a ride. And the closest place may still be Dawnstar. Um, let's see. Because that town didn't have anything. Let's go to... Where am I trying to get? Y'all, I confused. Uh, the journal says Alduin's Wall, Skyhaven Temple, which is near Markarth, sort of. But I want to take a ride to Karthvarsdasten. 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 Yeah, I think we gotta go to get the Dawnstar. That's where we gotta go anyway. So that's where we're gonna go. Let's set that destination. Yeah. Come in. Come in. Set the dest. Do it. Yeah, move it here. Good. Okay. Oh, but wait. I need to get on a road. Sort of. Yeah. Good. And off we go. Off we go to Dawnstar. You know, I hear you're the reforming the Dawn God. Uh, Dragon Hunters or something. All right, let's let's pick up the pace a little here. We have a long and bumpy road ahead of us to get the card right then. Is it rude of me to make fun of the? Nordic names and stuff. Oh, Trotsky, is that really all the stamina you've got for a fast run? That was terrible. I thought we were training you. This would be faster on foot. Oh my god, there are people talking about how excited they are to be drinking. I definitely uh, can't relate to that. Saber cat. Oh, that's the wrong button. Huh. Uh. Nope. 
Get off the horse. I guess Lydia will take care of it, like she always does. Lydia, move. Yeah, you did leave her. No Where'd it go? Lydia, did you kill it so hard that it was erased from existence? Damn, Lydia, you're rough. All right. This horse thing is not working out. Let's get out of here. Come on, Lids. We're going to hoof it. We're hoofing it and foofing it. That's right, you better run, Fox. You don't want to mess with this lizard. Dude, it's hot over here, y'all, guys. My ears are hot. I'm going to need to switch to earbuds or something. Which is totally unstreamer-like. Streamers always have big, giant headphones on. And, like, if you don't have big, giant headphones, then you're probably not really doing it. I'm going to graduate to cat ears at some point. This is a fort that I helped take over for the Empire. Hail the Empire. This is, this is part of survival mode here. You can't fast travel anywhere, so you got to go to these ridiculous lengths essentially to get to what amounts to a bus stop. Okay, I'm too far away from everything, so I need to go to a place with some form of mass transit just so I can get, like, anywhere at all. So there's a lot of this trudging. which can be rewarding. Other times it can be just trudging. And then you use up your energy and you get cold and your character gets hungry and sleepy. It's, it's, it's not like other games. Hey, look. Wolves fighting a, uh, an ice wraith. See if we can help both of them out. There we go. Hey, I just saved you. Not cool. Oh, and a saber cat is coming. You stop it. And you stop it. And the horse is coming. Why is there a horse? That was wild. That horse came to my defense. I don't even know that horse. Sir, do you even know that horse? No, sir, I've never met that horse. Who are you guys fighting? What's happening? What did you kill? Another wolf. Ooh, look at the blood. I'm gonna take that dog meat. Tell you what. Oh my god, look at that blood. Alright, we're almost there. had me my druthers and I didn't want to mess up the whole game right now, I would be switching out my headphones because uh, I'm pretty hot right now. I'd be putting on some buds. But chances are I'm going to screw everything up because, because Skyrim is a special snowflake. Um, when you... That's right. I've got to go all the way to the boat because I can't take. Right, and will let me take the uh, the carriage. Is that right? Let me see. That's not the inn, is it? No, it is the inn. Yeah, that's the inn. There's no wait for a carriage here. So I've got to go get to the boat. This is like taking a really long flight and having a ton of layovers is what this is going to be like. 
I can't believe I'm not more popular on Twitch for choosing to play the game this way. Why wouldn't everybody want to watch this? There's my ride. Looking to hire a boat? I'd like to hire your boat. Oh, but you're not going anywhere worthwhile. Ugh, so I have to go all the way to solitude. Okay. Got to go all the way to solitude. And then I got to go and take a ride from solitude to a town. You talk to Ed Brothers. DJ has no words. Yeah, DJ, you say that to me every time I come here. I really don't need your abuse. Um, now, and I got to take a carriage to another town that'll be close enough to my goal. I can't even take it to a village, though, because the carriages in the big towns don't go to villages. They only go to the big town. So if the big town is kind of far away, well, then you're just out of luck, aren't you? Okay, carriage guy. What are you doing? Why are you hiding in the... Where did all this foliage come from? Jesus, what did I download? That is a... Dude. Why are you hiding in the grass? My Whatever. Is the safest way to travel. Hold on, I gotta make a mammoth steak and a rabbit haunch. I believe you that your carriage is the safest way to, tra to tra 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 travel. Where do you want to go? I guess I want to go to Markarth. Ugh. Climbing back and we'll be off. All right. I really got to find an alternate headphoning situation because it is hot today, y'all. I don't Best know where any of my buds are. I wonder if, what would happen if I tried to do my, um, my AirPods. Would everything go wrong? Would it be worth trying? Countries full of them down south. I don't know. Would that be worth experimenting with? What could go wrong, right? Except for everything. Let's let's see what happens. Because here's the thing with Skyrim. Let me pause. Here's the thing with Skyrim. At least when you've modded it up, maybe when you just play it regularly off of Steam, there's no problem. But here's the thing. Uh, if you change your audio output situation, meaning from the desktop speakers to a headphones, for example, the game will ignore this, the fact that you have plugged in headphones or unplugged headphones or something, and will continue to behave as though whatever the previous situation was is still in play. So, what I'm not sure about is whether if I move to a Bluetooth headphone situation, whether that will, uh, whether, whether the game will then switch to the Bluetooth headphones or whether they, it will continue to act as it has been. Now, the new problem, of course, is that as you've seen, when I alt-tab out of the game to deal with OBS or whatever, the game just won't come back to the foreground. It doesn't want to. It doesn't want to. I don't know why. So, hello, Fluffy. Welcome back. It's lovely to have you here. Um, I was just explaining how Skyrim is a delicate snowflake, uh, a flower, as it were, when it comes to changing over to a different window for half a second or changing your audio uh, outputs. So we're going to try that. We're going to try to uh, all those things, keeping in mind that the game will almost certainly not work. Um, so I don't need this right now because I can still hear myself fine because I'm in the same room as myself. Um, I'm going to get out the AirPods, which I believe are already... Um, I believe that my... Uh, 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 Computer's already aware of them. So give me a mo. Boop. We're going to connect. We're connecting to the pods. Let's see if that's working. It's trying. It didn't work. It says didn't work. And I'll bet that's because my iPhone is right here as my camera, and my AirPods desperately want to work with the iPhone. Good. There we go. Connected. Voice. Music. Excellent. My computer is telling me that the audio output is something else entirely, so we're going to change it to the headphones. 
Okay. And now I'm going to switch it back to Skyrim. See what happens. It's letting me come back to Skyrim. That's a good sign. However, I'll bet. Wait, let me take out this. Yeah, and confirmed, it is not accepting the audio output, which is just great. It's exactly, exactly right. Exactly what I wanted. So, I have to now go back to Skyrim. It's all because it's too damn hot. You know what I'm saying? Um, go back to Skyrim. Go back to Skyrim. Go back to... Oh, see, now it won't let me go back to Skyrim. Did I quick save before I started doing this? I'll bet you I didn't. I'll bet you I didn't. Because I'm smart. Yeah, it will not let Skyrim return to the foreground. So let me close some windows here. And see if that will make a difference. Got my task manager. Going to close some things. Going to end some tasks. See if we can uh, get somewhere. Bet we can't. Okay, you ready to come back, Skyrim? You ready? Let's see. No? Okay, so we're gonna just, we're gonna have to force close it. That's cool. And we're gonna launch it again. And we'll see if the audio comes through. I don't know. The stream still looks good. Well, that's good. That's something. That's something. I am getting, I think, yes, I am getting the game audio in my headphones. So that's good. But now what I also need to do is get back over to OBS and make sure that you all can still hear it. And this is what people watch Twitch for. Did I, is this a? Am I hurt? Oh my gosh, how much, how far back am I? Oh, I'm really far back. So none of that stuff I just did is there. I may as well not have even started. That's great. Okay, looks like the desktop audio is working. So that's something. All right. Okay. Can I go back to the game? Will it let me? Come on. No, it won't. I got to do it again. This is so great. This is the kind of day I'm having. This is the kind of life I'm having. Yes, fish with magic flames is how I feel. Fish with magic flames. Fish with magic flames. Fish with magic flames. Fish with magic flames. Oh yeah, my reaction is is what it's all about. This is why you, you you come for the show. It's for this kind of crap. Oh, how I wish there was a carriage here. But nope, nope. If we're gonna continue with this story, we have to make our way all the way over to a town. Dawnstar was the wrong choice, though. I I can see that now. Dawnstar was a bad idea. I think the next best idea is God help me it might be white run. I think it's white run is the next best idea. Good lord. All right, that's where we're going. We're going a white run everybody. Who doesn't love white run? It's such a lovely place. And look, I've already got my Location, hoobly do there. Ugh. All right. I have a really high-end gaming chair. I don't know if you knew this. It's from uh, S Staples Depot, and I've been look. I got caught in a rock. Look at me, caught in a rock. Been playing for five seconds, caught in between two rocks. Oh yeah, that's what I wanted to have happen. Can we sneak out of the rock? Can we first person out of the rock? No. Nope. Let's see if we can Fusrado out of the rock. I 
really want to turn up my volume, but if I try, I'll bet you I'll lose the game. But hey, I haven't gained anything yet anyway. So, nothing lost, right? Oh, it's not coming back. It's not, I gotta do it again. I gotta do it again. I love this so much. This is the greatest game play thing ever. Come, internet, and witness as I try to play Skyrim for more than five minutes without something going terribly wrong. It's that's why they made internets to begin with. Okay. I cannot, I cannot go back out of the game ever again, or I will lose my crapulations. All right, we're you're just we're all just stuck with this now. Luap Keshu, the Argonian Dragonborn will continue his quest now. No more delays. No more waiting for slow horses. We did have time to pick those snowberries. It was easy. It was not a big deal. Let's not make a big deal out of it. Do you think those wolves up ahead are going to stop me? No. No, that's not a wolf. That is a saber cat. And I'm going to I'm going to murder it in its face. Oh, and I hit Lydia, I think. That's exactly what I wanted to do. Everything's going exactly as intended. Yes. Okay. Uh, so, I'm sorry, Fluffy. How are you? It's nice to see you. Thank you for coming. And I hope that your uh, weekend was nice. I think there's bad guys there. Are there going to be bad guys there? Oh, there's a, no, there's dead guys. There's dead guys. Whoa, who pushed me? Oh. I think Lydia just pushed me. I don't want to go in there right now. I've done this dungeon before. I don't need it now. Yeah, I'm feeling real comfortable game. That's exactly how I would describe it. Do I want that? Why not? Uh, here we go. You're better now. Oh, I'll bet you are. Everything looks... Everything's better when you compare it to a regular Paul. That's how the stream is. It's great. Would you like to have like a new positive outlook on your life? You should watch Paul's stream and then you'll feel like, wow, I'm way cooler than that guy. I can't even imagine why he would decide to broadcast himself on the internet for other people to see. Like, not only is he uh, kind of messed up, but he makes bad choices. What was that? I hear something thudding. Oh, it's a giant. That is not a regular giant. That is a... Hello, sir. You're not going to give me an indication of what you are? Oh, he's not attacking. That's cool. That's all right, then. Good. That's fine. Nice to see you. Nice to meet you, Mr. Giant. Hello, Fox. I am warm and comfortable now, guys. I just, like, went across the entire continent, and I'm warm and comfortable. And I murdered that cat in the back. No, it's totes like that. Don't tell me it's not like that. It's totes like that. I'm going to make it like that. Look, I'm a 43-year-old man, and I'm using words like totes. Something is wrong. Something is deeply wrong. Why is he doing that? Why did he say those things? Ooh. It's a face-off. Need something. Oh, I've seen this before. And then the then the fight never starts. 
Like, they all stand around staring at each other, and the fight never starts. I don't know what this is about. Are we gonna do something? Do you guys wanna mix it up? Yes. Yes? What do you want, Blizzard? I wanna... I wanna start some... some crap. But... Who's in charge here? You guys are all just flexing at each other, and it's awkward. So I'm leaving. This is silly. You guys... you guys call me when you figure out how to fight. Um... That's... that's tots, pops, tots. Totes... Totes, popes. Hop on pop. No, you must not hop on pop. Bam. Bristle back. That's right. You heard Le Lydia is not having it. Can I tell you? Don't tell her I said anything. But my daughter. Playing Skyrim. On the Switch. She only plays it when she's at my house. What is going on? Terrorizing my property? Oh no. Oh no. You feral brown wolf. Bet you wish you hadn't come and messed with me. Whoa. Lydia killed something. I heard a dog yelp. Lydia's always killing dogs and kicking dogs. Oh, look at that guy. Good job, bud. But you feel real strong now. And it was a puppy. Way to go, tough guy. Uh, anyway. So my daughter's playing. She ain't so big on the whole questing thing. On the whole, like, let's go save the world thing. Or killing bandits. And I'm trying to adjust my office Staples Max chair. Uh... I forgot that my hat was like this, so now I feel really stupid. Um, she likes interacting with the other characters. This is how she plays Zelda when she uh, when she plays Breath of the Wild. She doesn't want to go and fight Ganon. Hey, kids, what's up? Um, she wants to go put on the various costumes and masks that Link can wear and go make friends with the uh, Moblins and Bokoblins and other critters and, like, pal around with them. Dancer. She gives them na She gives the names. She gives them names. One of them is named Jazz Hands. She named a big old Moblin Jazz Hands. So that's what she likes to do. In uh, Skyrim, look, I came all this way just to find this guy. Need a ride? Yes. Wait. My carriage is need oh, he's not giving me a ride because the game thinks I'm in combat with a non-existent enemy. There's nobody here. Good lord, this game. And now I could go and try to track down whatever that lone enemy is. But, you know. What do you got, is everything well Uric? Take a look. Tell me what you got, Uric. You got nothing. You got nothing. I got nothing for you, Cap. I got nothing. No plan. Zip. Zero. Nada. Yeah, the movie I'm doing is Endgame. That's your big movie quiz for today. That's your movie thing. Go in a house. Yeah, I know. But that doesn't always work, is the thing. You go in a house, and then it's still there. So I'm going to try to go into town. I was telling the story, right? I'm going to open my window in a second. Uh, so my daughter's playing Skyrim. And, like... Immediately, the thing she does in Skyrim is, like, finds a way to get married. Right away. Gets them kids adopted. As soon as possible. So you gotta have a... See, look, you hear the battle music is still going. The game thinks I'm still in a battle. Let's see if it'll let me go to sleep. I'm gonna go to my house. So, yeah, so she gets married. She adopts kids. 
She builds a house. She has the house Carl. She has the whole shebang, right? She loves that stuff. More power to her. I love that that's how she likes to play. I'm going to do a nice long sleep. Um, hey, and maybe if, maybe if I'm lucky, he'll never wake up. Um, and she starts to get upset playing the game. And very often, if she's upset, it's because there's something she can't complete. Or, like, her house gets terrorized by a giant, and she doesn't know what to do. And it's not that hard to kill. She's playing it on easy mode. But she just it's not what she's playing it for. I should... Yeah, a moblin called Jazz Hands. That's right. Um, so. That's her situation in the game. She, uh... Oh, I never cooked that. Oh, God. That's how she likes to play, which is great. I love that she likes to play that way. I think it's fantastic. I think it's fun. And uh, it's a credit to these games, like Zelda, like Skyrim, that you can play that way. That you can emphasize, like, Dragonborn, whatever. I don't care. Bandits? Ulfric who? Storm what? I don't care. Like, she just wants to live in the world of the game and play it how she sees fit. Fan-freaking-tastic. I love it. Look how much damage that bow does. I'm not taking it, though. Um, here's what I'm leading up to. For somehow, last time she played, because she only plays when she's at my house, eat that thing there. Yummy. Uh, she only plays me. She's my house. So she, you know, doesn't always remember quite what she was doing the last time she was playing. And like all good Skyrim players, she has Lydia, like I do, following her around. See? Now my Lydia, of course, looks like a goddess Valkyrie because she deserves to. Um... But the long and the short here, folks, because, well, maybe just the long, because it's been the long. Uh, and I say folks, but I mean, you know, Fluffy, because he's the only one here. Um, the long and the short is that she loses track of Lydia. She starts the game, and she cannot remember where Lydia is. Now, I know what you're thinking. Well, just go back to your home, probably Bree's home in Whiterun, where I just was. Where is this guy? There he is. I can take you. Where do you want to go? I don't want to go to Markarth. We'll That's where on. I gotta go. Um. You ready to go yet? What was I saying? So, probably you left. She. That's where she goes. If you dip, if you part ways with your house, Carl, and Lydia is a house Carl for White Run, she's gonna go back to that town. And if you have a home there, she's gonna go back to that home. But she's not there. And so the only other real possibility, beyond, like, you sent her home and she's still on the way, you know, because they do take real time, game real time, to get back to wherever it is you told them to go. Um, you know, unless you're, she's maybe on the way, then that's more or less it. Other than you had told her ready the two most powerful words you can say to your companion wait here well that's easy you just uh yeah she lost lydia so but that's easy right go like well where did you tell lydia to wait she can't remember folks we traveled all around the great province of skyrim we went to inns, we went to uh, longhouses, we went to Dragon's Reach and Bree's home, we went to uh, places with ridiculous names and places with even more ridiculous names. Look, it's more revelers who are drinking. Oh no, I don't want to drink any anything with you, sir. Thank you so much, though. I appreciate it. All right. No, I don't want to go there. No, no, no. 
We are going. Uh, where am I going? There it is. Alduin's wall is where we are going. Oh, we're so close. May your adventures find you fame and fortune. Yes, fame and fortune. That's that's what I think is happening. Hold on, there's two markers there. I want to make sure. The right one. Okay. So anyway, we checked everywhere. Not, yeah, in a field somewhere. Well, that's the problem. We even went to Raven Rock. We went to Solstein because she, for a moment, felt confident that she had traveled all the way to Solstein, which is not in Skyrim, which is like DLC content, and like told her to wait here. Oh, in some sort of uh, bug house. What in the world, Lydia? Trouble follows you everywhere, doesn't it? I swear. Um, but she just, we just, we could not find Lydia. But yeah, here's the crucial part, the crucial aspect of this story. It wasn't a simple matter of, oh man, this is, oh, look at Dragon. It wasn't a simple matter of, oh man, what a bummer, we can't find Lydia, this is so frustrating. This was the end of the goddamn world. Not being able to find Lydia was not just an inconvenience. It was not just disappointing or frustrating. It was a crisis. It was, uh, it, you know what? The best way I can think of it, of, to describe it, my daughter was grieving the loss of a friend because of the way she plays the games. The relationships to her are extremely important. And uh, in this case, she cared a great deal about Lydia. How can you not? I adore Lydia, so I get it. Even though she gets a little, little smarmy with I am sworn to carry your burdens, but whatevs, you know, nobody's perfect. Uh, and so she is just in tears, inconsolable, so frustrated that we can't find her. There's like a traveling storm at your neck. Like, what is going on over there? What should I do? I'll, I'll, I can make one of those. Here. Sparkly! What was I using? This one, right? Yes. Go shoot the dragon, Sparkly! Where's... Where'd it go? It's very far away. Oh, someone down there is fighting a mud crab and having a tough time of it. Maybe I should help them. There we go. You're welcome. Uh, so yeah, major, major crisis. Oh, I forgot this guy was following me. Esburn. <laughs> I'm in a bit of trouble here. No, you're not. You're fine. That's Esbern, voiced by Max von Sydow. I think it's Sydow. It might be Sydow. I don't know. S-Y-D-O-W. Who you may remember from uh, the amazing film Strange Brew of the uh, 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 Mackenzie Brothers of Great White North SCTV fame. That made no sense to the vast majority of you, but to those of you who it does make sense to, you will be delighted that I just did that. So you bring the smokes and I'll bring the beers, eh? Oh. Yeah, you need more lines as burn. This dragon is too far away to fight, I feel, because this is not what we're here for. We are here to go this way. So sorry I asked you to help there, Sparkly, but you're not necessary at the moment. Yeah, it, it's it's sad, right? Because you grow attached to these things. We've had these situations with Animal Crossing, which you know might feel a little more under, uh, understandable, given that you know it's like your village and your friends who you brought over, and they're like interacting with you in a neighborhood. And so if you know, oh, that's where I'm going. Look at that. So if for some reason you lose track of a villager, or a villager wants to move out, or something goes wrong with the game. You know, 
a kid is definitely going to be a little un is Delphine here? Are you kidding? What is it? When did you get here? It's starting to look like Esbern was right. Wait, is Esbern here? He was just with me. This is very confusing. Esbern! Whatever. If the game needs him to be here, he'll be here. So, you know, especially in the age of a pandemic, when the kids don't get to see their friends as much, obviously some of this is changing, but during the height of the pandemic, the game still thinks I want to fight the revered dragon, which, you know, I do, but it's not happening at the moment. Oof, I am still like in ESO mode about how to operate this game. So there's going to be a little bit of relearning going on here. Um, you know, part of the reason we bought the kids Animal Crossing near the start of the pandemic. You know, we don't normally just buy them games. Like, it's not a thing we do. Like, they, you know, have their own money they earn and stuff, and they have to buy their own stuff. But... We thought it was worth... Oh, because I solved all these puzzles. That's right. I already, like, did all this stuff. To make it a little easier on us. Well, that's good. Um, but we bought them Animal Crossing. Because we thought it would be a thing... Uh, oh, I'm going to foos rod dough. That would kind of make up... You know, wouldn't solve anything. But help make up for some of the things they were missing with social interactions. And stuff like that. And it was something that we could all do together. We were all like, we were on different switches and could be on each other's islands and then help each other with our islands and stuff like that. So that was cool. So I wanted that for them, but it also meant that they would get very attached to the characters and anything that went wrong was the end of the goddamn world. Yeah, see, I've done all this, you guys, and I just didn't know that, uh, was, I just didn't have Esbern with me at the time, so we're gonna have to, um, where's Esbern? Well, what do we do now? What the flying crap, game? Esbern's the one who gets us in here, right? Oh, I'm so annoyed. Do I gotta go back and find him? Delphine, help me out. Alduin isn't getting any weaker while we stand around here gawping at the architecture. She's the least pleasant person in all of video games. Oh my god. Well, my daughter is very sweet. The blades have always guarded and guided the dragonborn. Like, she's just a super sweetheart. I'm gonna kill... Is Esbern still, like, out there fighting the dragon? Is that why this is the thing? Like, I know these guys are anti-dragon zealots, but this is ridiculous. Oh my god. I really do have to go find and recover Esbern, don't I? This is insane. I am making no progress. I'm sure that's what's going on. I'm sure he's out there. Because he was just with me, and he's like, Oh, I'm in trouble here. Cannot even hire good help these days. Maybe wait. Oh, that's probably a good idea. That probably would have been smart. I could still do that. Let's try that. That's a good suggestion. Do a wait. Esbern? 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 He can't die. He's an essential character. Oh, this is ridiculous. It may be that one of the uh, mods I've got for followers and stuff could even find him. I'm not certain one way or the other about that, but I could try. The dragon is still out there. There he is. There he is. There's our guy, but 
I don't know if Esbern is there, but I guess he is determined. Because, like, they're all, like, later, they're all going to be like, you got to kill Parthenax. I'm like, I don't want to kill Parthenax. He's nice. And then, like, you got to kill Parthenax. No, nah, come on, dude. I'm right here. I literally just shot you. Get over here. Huh. Did I hit him? Did I hit him? I think I'm too far. Ugh. This is, this is like, I need a thume for inconveniences. What's he gonna go and fight and burn over there? Do I have to go all the way over? I'm so mad at everybody I work with. I mean, in Skyrim, not in real life. Oh, there's Lydia. Nice to see you, young lady. Thanks for, thanks for playing. Where's the damn, there it is. I'm so mad. Oh, now now we're in battle music again. Let's let's get a little help. See if we can get this to wrap up a little more quickly. Um, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? I don't remember how I do any of this. Okay. I don't know. I I just want to move on with my life. Ugh. All sorts of folks are there to take that thing down. Like a goblin warlord is working on it. Whoop. No, no, no. Come on. We need to finish this. Whoa! Who did that? It's getting ridiculous. There's too many enemies. Who shot me? But da dun 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 da da dun 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 da da dun 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 da da dun da da dun da da dun 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 there's a goblin shaman who needs to get shot. Oh my god, stay still. That's right, now he's dead. Oh, there's a lot of enemies right now. Slay the dragon! I gotta put the iPad in a better place so I can see the chat better. Look, he's all the way over there now. Is that where Esburn is? I'm so mad at that guy. If he's dead, I'll be even madder. Look at all the fun that happened over here while I was gone. Look at all these dead guys. Forsworns? Imperial soldiers? Look at all the death. It's just terrible. Oh, God, and I'm definitely profiting off it. It's the worst. I'm such a scavenger. What's in that bucket? Death blow at Urban Urper. I already know that book. What's in that sack? Nothing. Oh, garnets, goats. Garnets, goats, and graveyards. Alright, anyway. Where's the dragon? There it is. As burn. Where are you, lad? Who did that? These guys. Oh man, I am mad. This guy needs to die. This is like an all-out, like, multi-species battle. There was a time that I was good at this game, and I could actually hit a character that I shot at. I suppose those times have sort of passed. 
Oh man, he got Fusra Dode and he got shot by an arrow. That is not a good day for him. Okay, now you. Eh, he's dead. Oh, don't go away with the current. Don't do it. Stay. Okay. Hello. I'll take those. Thank you. Lydia. You should carry something. Lydia. She's probably off fighting whatever that red dot is. Yeah. Yeah. All right, well, I don't need these. I don't need all this. Don't need that. Or, who needs or? Or, please. But I do need Lydia. Fine. Fine, nothing matters. All those valuable items right there. Liddy, are you over here fighting a red dot? Oh, Lids, where are you? If I also lose Lydia, I'll be so unhappy. Is that my red dot? Yeah. Ow. Yeah. Oh. Man, I am afraid of you. There we go. Empty. Like my soul. Oops, nope, wrong button. That's that's the ESO button. <sighs> okay. So I'm a little off. I still have to find Esburn. That ain't him. I don't need to find Lydia. I do need to find Esburn. Now, I know that he came with... There was no wait here scenario. There was no my daughter and Lydia scenario. And even if there was, this is sort of crucial for the plot. What was that? I don't know. I'm seeing things. Oh, God. What am I doing? This is the Forsworn camp. Nobody's home, it looks like. <sighs> Let's see if he's here. Oh good, we had a uh, we had a spam. We had a spammy. What? How did you get in here? Alright. Alright, if Liddy is in here, then there's a problem. Because that means that Delphine is not here, and I need Delphine and Esburn. This is getting ridiculous. Let's do another wait. He'll die. Goodbye, Sparkly. Alright, Lydia, I love you, but you might be confusing the game, okay? Let's be very specific. Alright, you ready? Wait for me in... White run. Bye. Okay, I'm gonna watch you go. Now get, get. Skyrim always go burr. Just go burr in my soul. My cold, cold soul. All right. Yeah, get out of here. Be free. Not here. Don't, they're not here, I'll bet. My only hope is that they're waiting for me in there. But I have a bad feeling. Because I sure as heck didn't see Esbern out there. 
Max von Sidow, Sidow. Please be in there. Please just be waiting for me in there. They're there! Oh my god, it worked. Thank fracking god. Sup, Ez? Very entrance to Sky Haven Temple. Itself. Oh, it's the best. The Akaviri blood seal can only be opened with the right kind of blood. Uh oh. Blood, Dragonborn. I knew this was gonna get freaky deaky. All right. That's all. That's about Let's do it. Let's cut me open. Here we go. Ow. Like a Klingon getting married here. It's coming to life. Oh boy. Wait. My my boy's gonna need to eat. Before anything else interesting happens. You did it. Oh no, I ate a raw leg of throat. That was Where's the entrance? After you, Dragonborn. Oh, after me. You should have the honor of being the first to set foot in Sky Haven. Yeah, but look how sleepy my character is now. Here we go. Here we go. That only took a, a, a literal hour. Ooh. The Sky Temple. It's the Temple of Skies. I wonder what of these amazing carvings I should first pay attention to. Where should I go first? I just can't tell. Uh, folks? Where are they? Why are you so slow? Let's see what's up ahead. Yeah, I am seeing what's up ahead. I'm right here. Yeah, I know that you are capable of running. Oh, finally, Isn't something. Amazing? Wow, what's amazing? I just want to know how to defeat Alduin. Ah, of course. Not everyone has an appreciation for the artistic wonders of the world. Let me hey. see if I can find the right panel. It's not, no, it's not like that. It's that there's a end of the world coming. Why do you gotta be like that? These guys are not your most sympathetic allies, I gotta tell you. Alright, what do we got, Ez? Talk. Let's hear it. Talk. Amazing. Yes. Carry on. Ah, thank you. Excellent. Now, where were we? I don't know. Do a thing. Ah, here it is. Ah, yes, All right where the quest marker so, said it would be. You see, here is falling from the sky. The Nord Tom. Oh, Bastard there's the dragon head there. I couldn't really make that up. So does it show how they defeated him? Isn't that one? Patience, my dear. The Akaviri were not a straightforward people. Oh, Everything God forbid. Comes in Malinor, mythic symbol. Yes, yes. This here, coming from the mouths of the Nord heroes, this is the Akaviri symbol for shout. Mm -hmm. but there's no way to know what shout is meant. Uh, it's shout, shout, let it all out. These are the things sure. I can do without. Come on. Oh, yes. Presumably something rather... Thuming to you. Come on. Or even Alduin himself. Remember, this is where they recorded all the news of all the wind. They recorded so it on one wall and nowhere else. Have you ever heard of such a thing? A shout that can knock a dragon out of the sky? I've heard of crazier things. Um, the Greybeards might know. You're probably right. I was hoping to avoid having to involve them in this, but it seems we have no choice. Yeah, I'm no other research or scholarship would, would come up with these answers. 
Oh god, don't say that. The point is ours. Oh god. They have captured the point. I believe that Delphine is trying to capture my point. That sounded wrong. Um Whoa, what do you have against the Greybeards? If they had their way, you do nothing but sit up on their mountain with them and talk to the sky or That sounds great. The Greybeards are so I'm afraid of power that they won't use it. Think about it. Have they tried to stop the civil war or done anything about Alduin? No, nah, I mean No. They and they're would afraid of you to ask them your power. Trust me, there is no need to be afraid. Think of Tiber Septum. Do you think he'd have founded the Empire if he'd listened to the Greybeards? I don't know. I wasn't there. Uh, uh, the Greybeards may have a point. Power is dangerous. Only if you don't know how to use it. Ooh. All the great heroes have had to learn to use their power. Those that shrank from their destiny. Well, you've never heard of them, have you? Well, that's and sort of like unfalsifiable. That that's like Russell's teapot right there. But if you live in fear of what might go Doesn't wrong, it sound great? I'm going to live on the like third of the world for the rest of my damn life. Uh, anyway, what were you saying, Delphine? I'm sorry. I better go see what uh, Arngir... Ar 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 that guy knows about th this shout. Right. Good thing they've already let you into their little cult. Damn. Not likely they'd help. Oh, like the blades isn't a little cult? Come on. We'll look around Skyrim Temple and see what else the old blades might Come on. Us. It's a better hideout than I could have hoped for. Talos guard you. Well, thanks. Look here in the third map. Oh. The prophecy which brought the Alkaviri to Tamriel in the first place. Yeah. In search of the Dragonborn. Yeah. Here are the Alkaviri, the blades. You see their distinctive long swords. Now they need. Are you paying attention, Delphine? You might learn something of our own history. Delphine's not big on knowledge. Hey, did you say something? Anyway. Goodbye, Delphine. Let's uh let's poke around here for a minute before we leave. I'm sure there's cool stuff. I forget. It's been a while. Uh Skyrim? That takes you back to Skyrim? I thought there were other rooms here. I truly did think that. I think there are, but whatever. I don't even care anymore. Just get the his L out of here. Oh, it's dark and scary out of you. Okay, see, no fence at all. Oh, dear, interesting tins here? I don't know, I can't see. It's too dark. I want to turn down my light over here because it's way too bright. That's a little better. Hey, everybody. It's time for some mood lighting. That was creepy. Let's enjoy the aurora. Oh, how nice. Look at that. Look at the stars under galaxy. Isn't that nice? Yeah, it is nice. Yes, Paul, it is. Me a little. All right. Um, third of the world. We're going to the third of the world. Let's go. Let's go. It's the throat of the world as we know it. And I feel fine. Okay, the way to get there, we have to go to Ivarstead. And where we are currently is not at Ivarstead. Doodly do. So I think we want to go to Karthvarsten. Right? Or is that the one that did not have? That was the one that didn't have any way to get. No. No. No, that's not right. It was a different one. It was this one over here. It was this, no, it was, no, 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 it was this one. No, no, it was this one. Yeah, it was Helyarkin. We're going to go to, not Rorikstead, we're going to go to Karlvarten. In order to get 
to Ivarstead. So, north to Carthar. Oh man, I don't know what temperature it is where y'all who are watching. Maine is not supposed to be a hot place. It's one of the reasons I was happy to move here. But I'm not feeling comfortable at the moment. Oh, Lucinda's here. Hey, Lucinda, how you doing? Happy to see you. How are you this day? Are you were doing a lot of uh you have no obligations to anybody stuff, right? A lot of a lot of whole lot of nothing. Glorious nothing. Was that today? I saw you mentioning that and I got super jellious. It's eight degrees. Where are you? Eight degrees. Oh look, it's a dead giant. I didn't kill that one. I didn't do that. Who did that? Where the heck am I? I don't know, man. I gotta get the car fired. Before I get myself car fired killed. All the force one here ought to be dead. It might not be. Ooh, but I bet you I could take a nap while I'm here. I bet you I could find a place to sleep. Yep. Sure can. Oh, look at you guys with your emotes. Oh, Lucinda, I'm so jealous of your day. I hope it was great. I so badly need that day. I will not get that day for a long time. Maybe ever. I think I, think I will never be happy again. I think this is how that works. Uh, that might be a little strong, but you understand. Uh, what was I saying? Never happy again? Right. Um, anyway, I'm glad you got to have that kind of a do-nothing-for-anybody day. I'm so envious of that. I need it so badly. I need it so badly. So badly. Like, medicinally. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, Bluetooth earbuds today because it's too damn hot in here. Uh, I know that is very untwitch like and I may have my my Twitch license revoked by not having big honking uh, headphones on. But I really did start to wonder, like, ah, it ain't like I'm producing uh, an album here. I don't necessarily need the highest quality sound fidelity for the sort of, uh, let's say, low-end work that I'm doing. Who are you, bad guys? I swear, I was just looking to see if they had red outlines like an ESO to be able to tell if they were bad guys because I am overdoing it. Ow! No! How dare you! I wish I could do that move. That is one that is not reserved for our kind. Be dead. Come on out. Come on. Show yourself. Let's do it. Eh, I killed you anyway. Well, almost. No, come on. Be sporting. Sporting. You just shot your own face. I'm gonna need a thing. Uh, yeah. A little bit of that action. No! 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 I have not yet quick saved. I see your hand. And. Oh! Not cool! Stop it! Oh, thank God. Okay. Yeah, they don't counsel the out the outside uh, 
No, that's true. Um, they don't cancel the outside noise well. That is absolutely true. Um, these are AirPods Pro, which, if I were using an Apple device, would have uh, pretty decent noise cancellation. Um, but right now, they are being tethered to my PC, which means they have no such thing. Um, as cool as that would be. What, what, what kind of party was going on here, guys? Oh, another dragon! Man, the fun never ends here. Is it gonna play? Are we playing? Are we doing this? Come on, sucker. Why are you always turning? Ugh. Don't skimp out on cheap ones. The range could be bad for use on computer. Truth, these are not cheap ones. These work just fine. Uh, yeah, it's just too hot in here for the big fluffy earphones. But what I was saying was like, for the kind of work that I'm doing here, it's not like I need a uh, perfect studio quality, you know, sound here. You know, I just need to be able to hear the game. That's all I need. So, this is fine. But, my thought was... A noise gate for your ears. Oh, man. Whoa, what bit me? How dare you? That bear just snuck up on me. Not sporting. Um, I don't know if y'all have an opinion on this, but it occurred to me that, like, people who like pop in on the stream or whatever and see me they're like oh he's not a serious streamer because he doesn't have big poofy earphones on uh head why am i calling them earphones i never call them that uh headphones on um i love by the way i love my headphones i have the uh the dt770 pros biodynamic i love them they're great. They sound fantastic, and they are not horrifically expensive. Um, they're super great. And usually super comfortable. But it's too damn hot today for that. Oh, man. This is not the best way to get the cards fired in. Um, but the look, right? You expect to see a streamer with, like, a real set of cans on their ears covering their entire ear instead of having something just jutting out of their ear holes. I wonder if that's a thing where people are going to be like, oh, well, that's not serious. Or if, like, other streamers would be like, look at that loser. He's He's got Bluetooth earbuds on. He can't be a serious streamer. Just see a streamer with comically huge headphones with thousands of followers. Well, that's what they do. And they got the cat ears all the time. Oh, I have a bad feeling that Karth Barston actually doesn't have... Doesn't have the carriage, does it? Oh, man. Why? Karth Barston, why? And you know what? I think I knew that and I'd forgotten. Karth Barston, curse you. I knew better. I knew better. It's just been too long since I played this damn game. Okay. Well, Dragon Bridge. We'll go to Dragon Bridge. At this point, I could probably just go to the throat of the damn world, but no, we'll go to Dragon Bridge. Uh, so anyway, I do wonder if uh, there is, like, some sort of taboo in streamer culture, which, as you know, I don't understand. Like, I still don't even really understand what a pog is. Um, but there's some sort of taboo against not having real headphones. Ow. I hit my knuckle on my... Uh, I don't know if I've mentioned this before, but I'm a genius. 
What up, people on horses? What are y'all horsing up to? What the horse is going on? Oh, it's a noble. Excuse me. Go on a dragon bridge. Oh, someone's here. Yeah, whatever, man. You're hilarious. Oh, there's four swarms all over the... Because it's a four sworn place, which I've already done. I'm pretty sure I've already taken care of this place, but... Looks like they've respawned for some fun. Ow! No. Oh, that noble's gonna get himself killed. Ooh. I feel like my archery's gotten worse. This used to be my fang. Dog. Uh! Why ain't you dead yet? Be dead. Now it's your turn. Be dead. Why are you just standing there? And put some clothes on, for God's sake. What is with the barbarians in this game? And their nakedness all the time. Ow! You got blood all over the camera. Wait a minute. If you can hit me, you've got to let me hit you. I don't think I can. I don't know what that was. Come on. That's got to hit. It didn't. I'll try a little lower. Alright, this is getting stupid. A little closer. No, I'm not getting to it. What am I stuck behind? Who's dead? Are you dead? You're dead. I will take that. Who else is dead? What, I'm, I'm, oh, I'm chilly now? On top of everything else, I'm chilly. Come on, you butt. I'm not afraid of you. God damn dragonborn. How do you anticipate all my shots? Oh, it's not worth it. Forget it. I'm done. Had it. Had it! On a dragon bridge without you. I think I'm going the right way. Not great on the whole sense of direction thing. Um, mm, did I just... What am I doing? Where is it? Wow, I am not going the right way. I'm so bad at this. I'm bad at everything. Where is Iverstead? Way over here. Alright. Now the closest town is Rorikstead. So now we're going to Rorikstead. And we're going to kill that cat before it kills me. The streamer I follow has the most subscribers. Literally just uses earbuds. Don't let classists fill your head with nonsense. Well, nobody's filled my head with anything. This was me just speculating. Because again, there's all these like unwritten things. You know, uh, if not rules, at least, you know, um, best practices. And, you know, um, initial appearances. What is up with that weird cow? And that man that just appeared next to it. What is going on? Hello, farmer. Stay away if I were you. Oh, Oh, I should have listened. Hold on. Why? I'm on my way to a giant camp, and I can't keep your distance, and you shouldn't... Uh, leave. good Thanks. luck. You take care of yourself. Yeah, I have no intention of helping you with that. I don't know why your cow has tattoos. You have a very rebellious cow. 
Yeah, so anyway, nobody filled my head with that nonsense. I came up with that nonsense myself. Oh, sorry, buddy. Oh! Hi. You're dead. You're dead. That was really easy. Oh, there's more of you? Who else? What? Oh, you were faking it. No, maybe you weren't dead? Oh, God! It's a werewolf! Who's shooting at me? Oh, they're there. Yeah, that's right. Self-born nonsense. That's right. That's how you heard your microphone was crappy? Someone had to tell you? Like someone said something to you on your stream? Ooh, Royal Daedric Arrows. Yes, please. Someone else is still shooting at me. Really? Didn't you just see what I did to your buddies? They are literally all dead. Why did all those healing potions jump to the bottom of the menu? He's a tough one, this guy. Oh. And he has a dumb mask on. Buddy, aren't you vaccinated yet? Get with the program. <sighs> what town am I going to? Rorikstead. I'm from Rorikstead. Uh... I was one sweet on a girl from Rorikstead. She used to somethingy something something I forget. What's this place? This isn't Rorikstead. It's a fan. Oh, there's Rorikstead. Hi, Rorikstead. My character is so tired and hungry. Oh. Hello. Um. Wait. I want to make sure I've pronounced this correctly. Zarkanes. Z no. Zacharnes? Zacharnes? Zacharnes. Zacharnes? Zacharnes. That is an excellent name. Um, and the answer to that is yes. It's a mod for... It's called Immersive... Immersive Enemies? Or Immersive... No, Immersive Monsters. Immersive Monsters, I believe, is the name of this mod. Yeah, and it makes some something. more interesting stuff going on. Why am I up here? I don't even know. Hmm. Looking to protect yourself Let's or see. deal some damage. By the way, thank you for following. I saw that the follow happened, and that's very kind of you. Thank you very much for being here. It's awesome. I'm delighted. Oh, my what am I doing? Right, I'm unloading some crap. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Definitely don't need that. Mm, 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 mm. This is just for convenience sake that I'm doing this. I'm not like, obviously I'm not hurting for cash. Yeah, fine. Uh, what's he got? Anything useful? Nothing I really need. No, no, nothing I need at the moment. All right then. All right then. Okay, I'm Batman. You found the article. Oh, good. Oh, that's awesome that you did. I was wondering if people would follow on that. Uh, for those who don't know, I uh, submitted an, uh, uh, one of my blog posts to USA Today. They had put out a call for folks to submit stuff about Need gaming. Good and I was like, well, Take I have post. some ready-made stuff. I actually took uh, something I wrote on my Substack. Um, nearearthobject.substack.com and essentially cut it in half and uh, submitted that and they took it right away and it was great. I was delighted. Delighted! Uh, that that worked out as it did. Um, that was a, 
like a month ago, and they just put it up. And it's all about my survival mode thing and my learned lessons from, from playing it this way. Uh, it's been super cool. It was super cool to see that up there. I have got paid the tidy sum of zero dollars and zero cents. Um, and that's fine. I'm fine. Uh, but it was super cool. Uh, oh, she's put the link in there. Cool, cool, cool. And um, there's the, 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 they also posted it on Yahoo News. and that So if you run into a paywall, the one on Yahoo News is there too. Uh, hurting for carry weight. I'm always hurting for carry weight. This is the name of the game for me. Is I don't have enough carry weight left. I got a lot of firewood for making camping supplies. I guess I don't need all of it. But I'd like to have some of it. Never use the poisons. Wow, that's an expensive poison. I bet that would have been effective had I used it. Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm thinking of retiring off what I made off of that piece. Uh, but, you know, it's for the exposure. That's what it's for, is exposure. Um, no, but I was delighted that they took that. And, yeah, so I, uh, because I'm so smart, I included my Come Twitch handle in. there. Just stoked the fire. Take and a uh, the cold out. I got like, you know, a handful of folks showed up as a result of that, you being one of them. And I think that's awesome. Feels right Delighted. New life is so welcome and thank you for being here. I appreciate it more than I can tell you. <sighs> okay, my guy needs a good long nap. I need a good long nap. I need, I need the big sleep. Yeah, but I was proud to have that that run. That was a a nice a nice event to happen in an otherwise difficult few days. Renee knows all about it. I'm fine, by the way. I'm just fine. I ate a gourd. Okay. Now we're going to go get a... We're going to take the train to Iverstead. Not a literal train. They don't have trains. In... On Nern. In the fourth era. Um, oh, wait. No, I do it up here. Do, 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 By the way, this is also from a mod. Survival mode, as you might know. You cannot fast travel. Um, there are, of course, in the big cities, carriages that will take you to the other big cities. There's a mod that allows you to take carriages from smaller towns to smaller towns, which I do not feel breaks the idea of, uh, of survival mode, doesn't break the spirit of it. Others may disagree, but I think the idea that there would be a bit more mass transit in Skyrim than just five guys with horses, you know, makes sense to me. Here we go, to Iverstead. But, you know, some may feel that that is not being hardcore enough. I am not one of those people. Because, you know, you have to be able to have some iota of fun. You know what I'm saying? Any hoodle. I don't need to keep justifying it. You all already agree with me. There's no reason for me to keep going. Just someone who happens to be going the same place. You pay them to take a ride. Exactly. Exactly. And it has built in in order to kind of... Ooh, a fight. Who's fighting? Oh, it's a bear. There's a bear loose in town, everybody. Kill the chicken. I will save the town. Or I will miss. I will save the town. Save the town. And I will also take the feathers and the chicken meat. What you got for me? Anything? I don't care about that. 
You're welcome, everybody. Welcome. I'm the hero, Dragonborn here. Big hero guy is me. Wait, am I going the right way now? Boy, I better be. Yeah. Yeah, the chicken was the saddest cut of all. The death of the chicken. Is this the right way? This doesn't look right. Hold up. I know Ivar Stead. There we go. That's where I gotta go. Well, where's that guy who wanted me to do that delivery? I never did that. It's a guy who wants a thing delivered to the Greybeards. I can't remember his name. Did he go inside? I think I saw him go inside. But no, maybe not. Because I don't want to have to make this trip again, y'all. He's not here. Forget it. You missed your chance, bud. No deliveries for you. Sometimes he's out here. Nope. 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 All right. Throw to the world. The happiest place on Earth. Where you sit around and shout at the sky all day. This is what I do in my head anyway. You know, this might be a good opportunity to build up some, uh, uh, what do you call, uh, some of my skills in the other weapons and stuff. Mostly I'm doing this for a story at the moment because I'm, you know, pretty high level uh, in, in many ways. Um, let's do, well, let me look at him here. But it's nice to build up some of the other stuff. Let's get out the big axe, yeah? Let's get the big one. Yeah! Look at that thing. That is also from a mod, just to be clear. Now, if I were not playing this on survival mode, I could have just teleported my butt right back up to the Greybeards and not have to go through all this again. Look at that guy. He looks scary. It's a Minotaur! Oh, I missed him. Oh my goodness! I was not expecting that. Oh, and the game shorted out. Ooh, the game crashed, guys. Isn't that great? Oh, it crashed again. That's so great. Where is it going to send me? Let's see. Oh, come on. No, no, no. Come on back. There we go. You didn't see it, but for me, it was like a thing where like it wasn't going to like put the game as the forward window. I'm just having butt tons of problems with stuff like that. Oh, where did yeah. you put me? I'm in Rorikstead. I'm going to have to... I'm going to have to... Uh... No, what? No, no, what did I tell it? I didn't see. <sighs> Guys, I'm having a hard time. Oh, it took me to Markarth. How about not? How about no? No. Incorrect. Okay? Just not that. Jeez. I'm having a day. I gotta work tomorrow. Huh? Here's what I need. Listen, this is very important. Um, just so I don't have to go to my job anymore. I need uh, like eight thousand followers and subscribers. So this can be my job. Uh, complaining about the game can be my job is it absolutely necessary for you to bother me right now what how did i just complete that quest you don't... what do you want what on earth 
things are weird today, y'all. No, there he is. You, 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 stop, stop running. I know you're running from the bear. No, don't go in there. He's running away from the bear. This is so dumb. You're a full-time streamer and make 150 bucks every three to six months. You too can have this kind of glory. I will take that kind of glory. Oh, I'm not going to be able to talk to him because he's running for his life from the bear. So he won't talk to me. Oh, I'm warm all right, game. I'm very warm. So now we got to go kill the bear. If it's still here, there's a very upset cow. Where's the bear? I'm having the dumbest Skyrim day of my life. All right, he's coming out now. You've been a good friend to me. That means something. Well, there's the. Oh, I guess I already made the delivery. I thought I didn't. I've been to the being mad. Well, not that they would. I thought I had. I thought I hadn't. Okay, it doesn't matter. Look, but I think you guys who are watching now, all, all the millions of you watching right now understand I assume that obviously this is my calling hello friend um I was born to do this kind of work obviously obviously I mean I've even got uh bluetooth earbuds in that's just how badass I am so I sh certainly shouldn't have to go to my regular job anymore I mean, look how upset it makes me. See? See the face I'm making? So it's up to you three or four people um, who are now my favorite people in the world. Okay, let's not get killed by the Minotaur again. Uh, I need you guys to make it possible for me to quit my job. That's what I'm saying. Oh, he's mad. He's also going to be dead real soon. A boom. See? That's what you get for killing me before. Uh huh. A giant tusk? No, thank you. I don't think I need that. See you later. I wonder what other fun new things are going to be up here with this dangerous mod. Anyway, you wouldn't be a lucrative streamer if you didn't have Bluetooth earbuds. Exactly. That's how you know, for one thing, it shows that I'm super, super rich, right? So you already know, like, oh, he must be serious. Look how rich he is. Who are you? Keep an eye out for wolves. If you're cool. Will do. Very scared of wolves. Um, so that must mean I'm already successful and know what I'm doing because nobody who uh, is rich is not really smart everybody knows that um what was i i don't remember what i was saying because i'm not rich is the thing i work for a non-profit you know what i'm saying i have i have expenses and incredible amounts of debt so the point is everybody let's let's solve all of my problems through the internet and video games. That's what needs to happen. Oh, I did not mean to take that. The game is crashing. The game is crashing. The game is crashing. Anybody want to watch a different game? I just read to you guys. Speaking of that, of which, because I totally could, and I just, I made my glasses worse, wiping them on my t-shirt, now they look worse. Speaking of which, since we're stuck here for the moment, so, since we happen to be here, check it out. I showed this off, I think, on the last stream, but I'm going to show it again. 
Skyrim, the histories. You know, I'm gonna, let me click over here. Hold up. Hold up. OBS, come on. Come on, OBS. You're the only thing that wanted to be... I can't get OBS to come forward because Skyrim is now in its frozen state taking over my computer. So I... Anyway, I know that you can still see me at least. This is a, a, a book, all the Skyrim books. Volume 1, The Histories, and I have 2 and 3 down there. So maybe that's what we'll do at some point. I'll just read these to you. Yep, yep. And see, I can't even bring up the task manager right now because Skyrim will not let me see it. So bear with me as you have been so far bearing with me sometimes if i open up a new desktop and then i drag the skyrim window over to it then it will let me bring up the uh task manager it doesn't always work but sometimes okay it's working now don't get me wrong skyrim is still not working but at least now i can close it I get to start back at the bottom of the mountain. That's cool. Uh, I only have the one monitor, alas. This is not a laptop, y'all. This is my PC gaming laptop, which, is a, which was a huge splurge for me. I haven't owned a Windows operating computer in a very long time. This is all I got, right? You can't see it. Over here is my work machine, which is my iMac, which is owned by my nonprofit organization for which I work, um, which is great. It's a great computer. You can't play Skyrim on it. Because the whole thing, the whole reason I'm here on Twitch to begin with, it started with uh, having a Nintendo Switch. And I hadn't owned a game console in a very long time because children, jobs, time, etc. These things are all still in play, by the way. None of that's changed. Uh, I'm going to assume you all can still see the game. I don't want to even, like, try anything. What's a technology from 80 million years ago? What? Which one? PC laptops? Oh, there's the bear again, everybody. We're going to ignore that bear. We're not interested in the bear. There's there's the brave cow. Okay, good. Oh, iMac. No, no, no. iMac is current. IMac, in fact, they just released those new ones with the colors and the whatnot. And they're, they're hot stuff these days, those iMacs. Um, mine's from 2017 that I used for work. It's great. It's a great, great computer. Uh, but it is not for this. So anyway, so I'm playing. This, so I started playing the Switch. I was like, I'm gonna splurge. I'm gonna get me a Nintendo Switch, suckas. I get to kill the Minotaur again, and I'm gonna play Zelda and Smash Brothers. And at one point, I was like, you know what? I could get this thing that I wanted so bad that I heard so much about back in olden days. Ooh, I killed it in one shot. This thing that everybody was talking about. Back in the ancient era of 2011, uh, called Skyrim. It sounded so great. It sounded just like the kind of thing that I would have been into. And so uh, I thought I would get it. And so it was on sale at some point, which I realize it very often is these days. And I tried it out. And I was like, nope, because I could not make heads or tails of like the controls it was very fiddly. There were a bazillion menus. I could not figure it out. Um, at least it was not comfortable at first. I was kind of hoping for Zelda but gritty. And, you know, in a way, it sort of is that. But um, but I kind of put it aside for a while. And for whatever reason, at some point, I decided to give it another shot. And when I gave it that other shot, 
I was completely hooked. And I played and played and played and played and played and played and played. And I played and played and played and played and played. And then I made new characters and I played it all over again. And then I hear all about, oh, mods, mods, mods. Look at on the PC. Mods, mods, mods. I didn't know much about, like, the better graphics because as far as I was concerned, the, the Switch as it is was the highest end console I'd ever owned. And so it was not like I felt like I was missing out. I just killed a baby bear. I just want to point that out. Um, to me, it looked amazing. Like, if this is like old technology on the Switch, then I love this old technology. It looks fabulous. I am thrilled. But then I heard all about the mods and all the different stuff that you could do with that. And it just sounded like this kind of experience that I just needed to have. And, uh, you know, I was also interested in other games on PC. I just didn't really know about them. I don't really know anything about it. I didn't know what to get. Something be making some horrible noises up there. Oh, it's a troll. An elder troll. Whoa, why is that so fast? That is not supposed to be that fast. You know why that's... I know why that's so fast. I've got some necklace on here that's doing that. And it really shouldn't be doing that. Now let me, um... Get rid of it. Wherever the hell it is. Uh... Derp, 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 derp. Where the hell is it? Just give me a sec. There's some... Where is it? What am I missing here? I thought there was a necklace doing that. That's all smithing stuff. My armor. Two-handed. I'm not wearing it. Why is it doing that? That's the correct speed. Okay. Oh, it's still alive. Huh? There we go. That was fun. I definitely just dropped one of those things, but look, life is short. I gotta move on. Uh, you can wear ten rings. Yeah, uh, those are all for smithing purposes. Again, this is not a purist's survival mode. I definitely have a few mods for quality of life improvements and things, and one of them is like, I should be able to wear more than one ring at once. And as for the smithing and stuff, I don't really care. You know, I don't feel like I'm cheating too much. It's a minor cheat, don't get me wrong, but it's not too um, egregious. Uh, what the hell was I talking about? Uh, oh, there's all the stuff in the chat. You guys were talking. I feel so bad. Um, so cold, Burr. Yes. Well, especially for my little Argonian here, who is particularly sensitive to the cold. He hates this. Yeah, I murdered a baby bear, and I'm feeling fine about that. The Elder Troll is the troll that uh, wrote the Elder Scrolls. I don't know if you knew that. Do you study your lore, Lucinda? I'll bet you're not studying your Elder Scrolls lore. It's the uh, it's the troll that writes the scroll, and he does it in a hole. Um, and when he goes out on patrol, uh, he um, something something. Uh, what was I saying? So... I was like, okay, well, I'm going to splurge on a gaming PC of some sort. And that was, had to be a laptop. I don't have any room for another desktop in this damn house apartment. Um, and that was probably the only thing that I could afford. And I didn't want to have to think too hard about it because it looks like building a PC seemed like or purchasing a regular PC seems to be akin to uh, choosing which child you're going to adopt. It's like too much stress. And I have already lots of stress. So, uh, poked around, tried a few different laptops, rejected a bunch of different laptops. Blah, 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 blah. Got this one. Now, hello, Frost Troll, you coming down? Yeah, let's do this. No, don't run away. Come on, bring it. 
Yeah. No, don't run. Come on. Yeah. Oh, snap. Insufficient charge my butt. Or his butt. Nah, G. Uh. Oh! Oh! How nasty. So, um, wait, where are we? Where are we? Um, <laughs> if you have one million trolls writing stories in a hole, you will eventually get Skyrim. That is correct. That's actually a scientific fact. Scientific fact. Uh, where are all my salmon steaks? There we go. Okay. All right. What am I doing? Oh, let's charge our weapon, shall we? So that's the PC gaming part, is that Skyrim essentially was the gateway drug to other PC games, which honestly is still mostly Skyrim and ESO, but I'm trying some other things. The other part of it is that Renee, the lovely lady who is uh, often in the chat there destroying spam bots with her mind powers, um, was started to kind of get interested in some Animal Crossing streamers. I'd never watched anyone um one second here never watched anyone stream before oops did not want to do that uh my thinking being good lord why would any human being in their right minds ever want to watch someone else play video games that sounds awful and I will say, I am often still of that mind, but not all the time. But I, what I came to realize from the streamers that she was watching was that they were not, it really wasn't about the game playing. That was part of it, but it was really more about you like this person and you're hanging out with this person and you chat with this person and they're playing a game that you're interested in and yada, yada, yada. That it was more of a, a melange, a melange, a tapestry a confusion of all those elements. And I was like, oh, I'm starting to get it. And I'm like, well, I I like getting attention um, until I don't. I like getting attention. I have a PC. I have a phone that I can turn into a camera. I already had a mic even is slipping a little um i already even had a nice mic here for my uh occasional podcasting or music recording i was like i'm i'm ready to go and that is the story of how i came to be the biggest star in twitch history yay me um and then i had to learn what i still don't know what pogs are i still don't fully understand and what biddies are um and i have uh 40 plus followers who uh, were kind enough to uh click that button demolish that button destroy it decimate that like button that follow destroy it ruin its life um yeah that is that is my great story that you didn't ask for yay me and I made it to High Hrothgar. Yeah. Yeah. So one day I'm going to be a big, big time streamer like Lucinda. Ooh. Didn't see that one. Dragon Soul Shift. What now? What now? Is That's from the mod. I've been waiting for this. This might be a big deal for me. Converts a dragon soul to a perk point. I've had the mod installed, but I didn't I didn't read enough of it to know that you needed the spell book. I feel so dumb. This is a problem I've been having with not reading things entirely. Chappelle. Alright, we'll get to that later. It's definitely a quick save page here, you know what I'm saying? Um I don't remember what we were talking about. Or what I was talking about. You're laughing your rear off. Book of Love Quest. Oh, yes. The Book of Love Quest. You gotta love that one. 
That one's kind of a pain in the butt. There's Arn Gear. Arn Gear Near? Near. Arn Arn Gear. Arn Gear. Christopher Plummer. Ah, you've retrieved the horn of Jorgen Oh man, I retrieved that horn so long ago, buddy. It's been taking up weight in my backpack this whole time. It is time for us to recognize you formally as Dragonborn. You haven't recognized, but what about all the thuming I've been doing? Oh, what's that one? Okay. I guess we're gonna go recognize me formally, everybody. Should I put the axe down? You think I'm being a little too intimidating with this thing? Just walk around with this giant. Here, let me show you what it looks like with just my guy here. All right. Like, excuse me. Pardon me. Giant axe. Excuse me. Uh, don't. I won't hit you. I promise. Ugh. God, that thing is heavy. All right. Hold up. That looks terrible with the with the arrows back there. I gotta take that off. Get that out of there. Okay. Dog. What are we doing? What's da happening? Together, this shout is much more powerful. Reading in 2021? Who, do, who does? Literally. What's... I got problems, guys. You know, it's an ADHD thing, I'm sure. But, like, especially in ESO, Elder Scrolls Online, the descriptions of what different items do are very long and the numbers have many digits in them and it's not like base 10 digits right it's like this does 874 i'm sorry 8743 points over two second cool off time with uh with area of effect that does a thousand of uh fire uh, damage and uh, requ you know, like very lengthy descriptions and so often I'm just like oh that weapon's bigger stronger than the one I got ka -chink, equip but and I've been too lazy to read those very nuanced instructions and I'm finding as I go through the game that this is a mistake that I should know these things um, I am jury is out on whether or not that part is fun. Sometimes it feels like work. And I don't like it when a game feels like work. Uh, for the sake of work. But so far, I'm, d I'm down with it. So, but, I, but my point is I have a problem sometimes with reading all the stuff. Back in my day, when I was littler, littler than I am, um, you know, here's the text you got from an important thing. It was, uh, it, it's dangerous to go alone, take this. And then you got a sword. And the sword always did the same thing. And then, and then suddenly we're at, you know, your area of effect has a cooldown of seven to blah, blah, blah. And it's hard for me to adjust, is what I'm saying. <sighs> anyway. What's going on? Excuse me, uh, sir. Can I ask you? Can I ask you a question about shouts? He's not gonna. No, he's gonna give me another very long story. All right. First, Master Wolfgar will teach you the final word of unreal. Oh, I've been waiting for this one. You are ready. I feel ready. Should I go walk over to it? Can I have it? Yes. I can now foos, row, and da. Oh, I shouldn't have waited this long to get here for this. Oh, yeah. Oh, we're foos, row, dod. We've done it. We've foosed. Oh, it's already active. I don't have to spend a dragon soul because it's already there because it's part of the quest. We would speak to you. This was my training? Where you've been training me? Prepare yourself. You can withstand <laughs> Sorry, dudes. Sorry, everybody. My stomach's grumbling. It's like, I am ready. Ah! What are they doing to me? Voth need balan. Clove pran. 
now. Clove prawn now. Clove prawn now. Cloves for prawns now, please. Grim Dawn game is like that. Uh, someone recommended the game to me and I finally played it. I told them I'm not reading off 15 different item attributes. It's not, that's how I feel. That's exactly how I feel about it. I'm still shaking here from old men shouting at me. It's like, what am I, walking by a construction site? That's me. You have tasted the voice of the Greybeards. That's disgusting. Through unscathed. Hi, Hrothgar is open to you. One would hope. Okay, we have another thing we need to talk about, sir. Sir, Christopher Plummer. Sky, guard you. Yes, here's the thing. I need to learn the shout used to defeat... Where did you learn of that? Who? Who have you been talking to? Who? Who? I have hit a sore subject. Um, let's see. It was recorded on Alduin's wall. The blades, of course. They specialize in meddling in matters they barely understand. Aren't they the worst? I hate those guys. No bound. They have always sought to turn the dragonborn from the path of wisdom. That's what I was saying. Have you learned nothing from us? No. Would you simply be a tool in the hands of the blades to be used for their own purposes? Also no. Um, let's see. Oh, I could get passive aggressive. At least the blades aren't keeping secrets from me. Um, the blades just want to defeat Alduin. Don't you? What I want is irrelevant. But I, but I want in the yeah, I'm in trouble. I'm in trouble. Alduin was not meant to be defeated. Those who overthrew him in ancient times. Not meant to be defeated? You know what he sounds like? He sounds like an apocalyptic, like, you know, end times millenarian, right? Like, uh, this is supposed to happen. Um, it's Ragnarok. So you won't help me? No. Not now. Not until you return to the path of wisdom. But we got to stop Aldo. Ween, did you hear that rumbling? I have given my answer. Go and reconsider your course. Who's talking? Why is there still an arrow over your head? Uh, forgive me. I was intemperate. I allowed my emotions to cloud. Yeah, you did have a little bit of a hissy fit there. The decision whether or not to help you is not mine to make. No, no, it's not. So, can you teach me this shout? No, I cannot teach it to you because I do not know it. It is called Dragonrend, but its words of power are unknown to us. Oh, Dragonrend. I saw that on Broadway. Dragonrend holds no place within the way of the voice. Uh, I thought you knew all the words of power. But not Dragonrend. The knowledge of that shout was lost in the time before history began. Hmm, convenient. Perhaps only its creators ever knew it. But I am not the one to speak of it to you. I need a Snickers. That's what I'm saying. Um, what is so bad about Dragonrend? It was created by those who had lived under the unimaginable cruelty of Alduin's dragon cult. Mm. Their whole lives were consumed with hatred for dragons. Mm. And they poured all their anger and hatred into this shout. Well, that it sounds pretty useful. When you learn a shout, you take it into your very being. In a sense, I do feel like an unrelenting shout. force a you lot of the time. If you learn and use this shout, you will be taking this evil into yourself. Hmm... If the shout is lost, how can I defeat Alduin? Only Parthenax, the master of our order, can answer that question, if he so chooses. Well, let's learn about Parthenax, shall we? Why haven't I met Parthenax yet? He lives in seclusion on the very peak of the mountain. He speaks to us only rarely, Gosh. and never to us. What other kinds of things Being live on the peaks of mountains in this game? Who is Parthenax? He is our leader. He surpasses us all 
in his mastery of the way of the voice. Ah, it's almost like he has some sort of genetic thing where it's like easier for him. Um, how do I get to the top of the mountain to see him? Only those whose voice is strong can find the path. I feel like we will we... teach you a shout to open the way to Parthenax. Well, that would be good. All right. What? So we're so we're 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 walking. Okay. We're walking real slow because nobody in Skyrim is ever in a hurry. We're always just sort of flirpy derping our way. Nothing urgent, just trying to stop the end of the world. But no big deal, you know. I don't got anywhere to go. It does sound like a bad idea to learn that shout, but I think I'm going to do it anyway. Because, uh... Well, because I think the game needs me to do that to proceed. Um, but also, because uh, I'm a real nice lizard. Here I am. Look at him. Would he ever do anything uh, morally questionable? No, he would not. Please ignore the axe with a naked demon on it, on his back. All right. All right, Christopher Plummer, can we speed this up? The path to Parthenax lies through this gate. Mm -hmm. I will show you how to open the way. Let's do it. Let's do it as slowly as possible. Let's do it. Follow me. Yes, I am following you. Whoa! Ah, yes, I must learn the clear sky's shout. Need to spend dragon souls for those oh i do look at that there's one more right i gotta get this other one yeah i will grant you oh no he's gonna give me the clear skies this is your final gift from us dragon Lord. is he gonna give me the uh the soul mojo yeah Whoa. Joe. I'm ready. The path to Parthenax is perilous, not to be embarked upon lightly. Keep moving, stay focused on your goal. Yes, sir. You will reach the summit. You better believe I will. I'm going all the way up there, Keep suckers. Moving. Let's do it. Alduin is toast. Okay, bye. Oh, I should probably queue it up before I derp um clear skies yeah here we go let's go see parthenax let's go see oh why why oh i see okay i haven't done this since i did it on the switch and you know it's kind of hard to see things on that thing I'm so excited, and I just can't hide it. Kuta! Kukala Pukala! Oh, it ain't, it ain't recharged yet. Ooh. Come on, recharge. Come in. I don't need the whole thing, apparently. Whoa! Things got shaky there. What was that about? Oh, a dead goat. That's a great sign. I am chilly. Oh, you're not kidding. Yeah. Uh. Nah, come on, man. Now I go back to first person. not quite clear when you're in Mistville and when you're not. Sort of. Yeah, all right. Ah, ah, shoot! Gesundheit. I'm gonna go learn that bad idea shout now. Oh, I missed. Okay. 
Uh. Uh. I've contracted gut worm. Who's jealous? I've contracted gut worm. Uh. Oh, he's parallelized. Nah, he did. Nah, he did. All right, I gotta, I gotta cure disease thing in here. Um, I thought I did. There it is. Yum. Oh, I feel so much better. All right. I've contracted gut worm. Ooh, hi. Uh. Face my wrath. Okay. How's the wrath facing going? Yeah, yeah. All right. Quick save. In case the game crashes again. Oh, right. I forgot the shouting. Baka! Baka! And now, Dragonborn, I will teach you the shout of the awakening. All of those who reside on your homestead will be forced to open their eyes to a new day. And it goes... See, what? this is why I should be a famous streamer. That kind of comedy, you're not going to get that from anyone else. From uh, other streamers who I've heard of, like Mr. Ninja Beast and Dr. Disrespecting Beasts Ninjas and Pewdie Beast. You, you know. Oh, hey, Owen. Welcome, welcome. I hope you are good. I hope you are having a good day where you are far away from us, which you were not earlier today. You were in the house with us. Lock. That, whoa, whoa, whoa. Why, why is that happening? Come on, I zoomed. I would not have been able to do this earlier in the game because my guy would have already frozen to death. Um, throat of the world, discover! Oh, there's Parthenax. Spoiler alert. Drem Yolok, greetings, Wundunik. I am Parthenax. Oh, this is awkward. Who are you? What brings you to my Strumach, my mountain? Oh, this is the thing that Parthenax does, I forgot. He likes to uh, throw in little words of dragonese in the middle of his uh, 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 common language sentences. Uh, I wasn't expecting you to be a dragon. I am as my father Akatosh made me. What? Saw you, Dover King. Uh, and I got a grumbly stomach Tell again. Me, why do you come here, Volan? Why do you intrude on my meditation? Is that literally all you do up here? Uh, I need to learn the dragon rend shout. Can you teach me? Hmm. Patience. Well, now we know that dragon means patience. Which this is like Duolingo death, for dragons. The first meeting of two of the dove. It's all about the immersion. Wait, what were you saying? Long tradition, the elder oh, you're going to teach it to me. Go ahead. Do it. Hear my thumb. Yeah, hear my thumb. It in your bones. Oh, in my bones? It, if you are Dovahkiin. I am Dovahkiin. Oh, yeah. Whoa! Whoa! A little too close, buddy. I didn't realize that Parthenax is going to be a close talker like that. I am freezing. A gift, Dovahkiin. You understand fire as the Dove do. Yes. By the way, I'm freezing to death. So, hold up. A little hot cabbage soup. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Feeling it. Feeling it. Oh, yeah. 
You're really gonna have that quest marker over your face like that the whole time? Let's take that off. Okay. Alright, I need to use my new fire breath. Strike me with the fire of your thumb. Really? Cool. Huh? Huh? <laughs> oh, he's into that. <laughs> yeah. I like I like burning. It is long since I had the pleasure of speech with one of my own kind. I have yeah, my own kind. I am a lizard. So you yes. have made your way here. Oh, a little too close, buddy. Oh, the breath. No easy task for a uh, breath. Mortal. Jewer means Even mortal. One of Dovasos. Dragon blood. Dova sos means dragon blood. What would you ask of me? I need the dragon rent. Um, dragon rent. Ah, I had expected you. But I actually I asked that at the beginning of the conversation, so it's not you like not come all expecting. This way for Tinvak with an old Dova. Yeah, really. No, you seek your weapon against Alduin. Yes, I think again. I think I said that. Maybe not. Um, I think, didn't I say that? I don't remember. Um, the Greybeards didn't want me to come at all. Mm, yes, they are very protective of me. Bachlan Fadon. I don't know if that means they're protective of me. But Maybe I it does. I do not know the thum you seek. What? Krosis. It cannot be known to me. This is ridiculous. Does this thum even exist? Your... Mortals created it as a weapon against the Dove, the dragon. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Our Hadrime, our minds, oh. cannot even comprehend its concept. My Hadrime is uh, bleeding out my ears right now. How can I learn it then? Drem, all in good time. Oh, Drem, remember, First, patience. A remember? question for you. Why do you want to learn this thum? We've been over this, Alduin. <laughs> I like that one of them is none of your business. Oh, I like this. I like this world. I don't want it to end. Cruza has good a reason as any. There are I many think he's somewhat disappointed. As you do, although not all. No, no, no. In fact, I'm not so sure I actually Some feel that way. I just thought it was a cute response. All things must end. So that the next can come to pass. Yeah, well, maybe Perhaps the next thing doesn't need to come to pass right now. The egg of the next Kalpa, Lean Vokin. Would you stop the next world from being born? Yes. Uh, the next world will have to take care of itself. Pause. A fair answer. Pause means a fair answer. Rofus. Maybe you only balance the forces that work to quicken the end of this world. No, no, no. Even we who no. ride the currents of He's time not listening. cannot see past time's end. Ulsetid los trahodis. Gesundheit. Those who try to hasten the end may delay it. Yes, Those that's what I'm going for, delay delaying it. End may bring it closer. No. Nope, not bringing it closer. But you have indulged my weakness for speech long enough. I believe that I have. Krosis, now I will answer your question. Oh, this is taking so long. Mm. Do you know why I live here? Not even able to move. At the peak this is it. That's all I can do. Bonavin, what you name throat of the world? Because uh, nobody wants to talk to you for this long? Uh, huh, no, dragons like mountains, right? Um, you said you were going to answer my question. Grim, patience. Oh my I am answering. And I'm all out of my, my drink. Way. This is the most sacred. We literally talked about. Oh yeah. Skyrim, That's true. Struma, the great mountain of the world. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Here, the ancient tongues, the first. Notice that time is passing in the game. The voice, the sun is gone down. Alduin and defeated him. Uh huh. Using the dragon wren shout, right? Mm, yes and no. Oh, of course it's yes Zeke and no. Alduin was 
was not truly defeated either. Mm. If he was, mm. you would not be here today seeking to defeat him. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. The Nords of those days used the Dragon Ren shout to cripple Alduin. Yes. But this was not enough. No, it wasn't. Mulag Unsrad. Oh, tell me about it. It was the Kel. The Elder Scroll. They what? Used it to cast him adrift on the current. I'm pretty sure the Elder Scrolls are important. <laughs> An Elder Scroll? What's that? Hmm. How to explain in your tongue? Oh God! I the wish I had not have words for such things that jaw do not. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It is an artifact from outside time. Oh. It does not exist, but it has always existed. Rahwatlan. Oh, Rahwatlan, indeed. Fragments of creation. Oh, that sounds like a mess. The Kelly. Elder Scrolls, as the you know. Kelly. They have Kelly, 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 Kelly. Yes. Your prophecy comes from an Elder Scroll. Ah, oh, what a coincidence. But this is only a small part of their power. So far, Suryek. Oh, God. All right. Are you saying the ancient Nord sent Alduin forward in time? Not intentionally. Well, no, nobody would do that Some on purpose. He would be gone forever. Forever lost. May ye. Hey, hey. I knew better. Mm. Teed, bo, I'm a tea. You know what I'm saying? Time flows ever onward. One day he would surface. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Which is why I have lived here for thousands of mortal I years. I think we've been talking here I for thousands waited. of mortal years. I knew where he would emerge, but not when. Okay, how does any of this help me? Time was shattered here uh -huh. because of what the yes. ancient Nords did to Alduin. You know what? The Nords have a problem. If you they are not Kel, responsible people. That Elder Scroll back here to the Teed Ahran. The time wound. The time wound. With the Elder Scroll that was used to break time, you may be able to cast yourself back to the other end of the break. That sounds like a bad idea. You could learn Dragonrend from those who created it. Ah, well, it's not like technology or culture is advanced over the various millennia that these games take place and so yeah okay do you know where i can find an elder scroll Crosis. no i know little of what has passed below in the long years i have lived here yep you are likely better informed than i okay well i'll ask somebody else the lore keeper at the college of winterhold might know trust your instincts Dovahkiin. i always your do blood. We'll show you the way. Oh, that's gross. I have a lot more questions I have to ask him now. Um, what do I do with an Elder Scroll when I find it? Return it here. Not read it? Can I read it? Kele Vomindok, guys. Kele Vomindok. I believe. The scrolls bond with the Teed Ahran uh -huh. will allow you a, a seeing mm. a of the moment of its creation. Dune reference I just made. Then you will feel no dragon rain. I am the dragonborn, the Kwisa Tadarak. First expression. You will see them. Wow, this is. Adon, my I did do this once before. Taken. Maybe a year ago now. I do not remember it being this long. Hakon, Gormlaith, Feldir, who are they? The first mortal 
those that I taught the Thum. Boy, was that a mistake. The leaders of the it took me 5,000 mortal years for me to teach them the Thum. Lucinda, it's bedtime for me, but Parthenax is still going. So, hey, thank you very much, though, Lucinda. Thank you for being here, as always. I love that you come here. Thank you. Bye-bye. Good night. Sleep well. Okay. What could an Elder Scroll cast... Uh, how could an Elder Scroll cast Alduin through time? Woman, dog. I, do, I not do not know. Perhaps, Perhaps in, in the very doom, long between. They oh, I don't know what I said long there. From I gotta try another Parthenax. Hold on. The Dove the are dove children, are children of Akatosh. Thus, we are specially attuned to the flow of time. Oh, and my lizard belly is grumbling again. He's been talking so long that I'm going to die of starvation on this mountain. No, I think they tried to listen, but you took too long. You mean you were there? Yes. There were a few of us that rebelled against Alduin's Thur, his tyranny. Ugh, I hate we his Thur. He flaunts it like... Overthrow. Look at my Thur. I have the best but Thur. But they did not trust us. Neov. Neov. Their inner councils were kept... I am tired. Look, it says I am tired. I am tired. I was far from here on the day. Boy, these jokes just write themselves. What? Oh, God, there's two more? What does the Dragon Wren shout actually do? I cannot tell you in detail. Can I, I skip through these? I can! It was said to force a dragon to experience the concept of mortality, a truly von Midoran, incomprehensible idea to the immortal dove. You're the master of the Greybeards. Do others come here to train? I have taught the way of the voice for centuries, and the Thum since long before that. But no, Dovahkiin, others do not come here to train anymore. Saran, you are the first in over a hundred years. I meditate on the Rotmulag, the words of power. I counsel in their use. It is enough for me. You meditate on the words? How? Knowing a word of power is to take its meaning into yourself. Contemplate the meaning of a Rotulag. You will become closer to that word as it fills your inner self. Will I teach you Dova Keen the word that goes into deeper understanding? There are three master of Fus, Fime, and Yol. It is called force in your tongue, but as you push the world, so does the world push back. Think of the force that may be applied effortlessly. Imagine but a whisper pushing aside on its path. That is Fus. That let its meaning fill you. Sum Ark Mora. You will push the world harder than it pushes back. I have to do all of these. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. Which calls uh -huh. to you? Yep, 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 yep. Learning them all, learning them all. As the fire builds. Oh my god, am I done yet? Oh, no greetings. No, we're done. Bye, Parthenax. Bye. Oh, wait. Oof. Why did you fall? Okay, bye! Or not. Why are you doing that? What's the matter with you? Okay. Okay. Well, it was nice seeing you, Parthenax. I think we have to be done now. Because the Parthenax took about a zillion years. It's just fun. Okay, that's cool. Oh, somebody sent me a text message. I don't know what that was. Okay. Um... Thank you guys for coming by and hanging around with me and my new buddy Parthenax. Um, maybe we should make a talk show out of this. Just uh, like Parthenax could be like the sidekick. And like every time the host tries to move along, the sidekick just keeps going. Um, Our next guest has a wonderful thawoom. Her voice rocks the world and the world pushes back. And then the host is like, come on, man. Come on, Parthy. Come on. Let's do this. Let's do this. Anyway. Hey. Thanks for suffering through this with me, everybody. Because that is what life is. Life is suffering. Tee hee. Ha ha. 
and I hope you have a lovely evening and thank you for being here. Oh, and by the way, your job is to get me a thousand million followers so I can become a big star here and not have to do my regular job. Remember that? Remember that? It's your job. It's your homework. Okay. Mwah. Good night.